My name is Lee Higginbotham. I work at an outdoor power equipment dealership and have been in the industry for 20 years. What we will be talking to you today about is safety, operation, and preventative maintenance on a chainsaw. The first thing I'd like to discuss with you is some of the apparel that you will need when you're operating a chainsaw. When running a chainsaw, I highly recommend that you review your owner's manual so you're able to meet all of OSHA and ANSI standards when operating the saw, whether it be in a residential or a commercial environment. The first piece of apparel that I want to recommend that you use when operating a chainsaw is a pair of boots. Typically you want to wear a high cut boot that's going to go partly up your ankle. The second thing that we feel that is imperative anytime that you run a chainsaw is a pair of safety chaps. It has material inside the chaps that is designed to stop a chain within seconds. So you minimize losing a limb or minimize the number of stitches that might incur when operating a chainsaw. The next thing that I'm going to recommend to you if you're working in a commercial environment is a safety vest so you can be seen. The other item that is very important is work gloves. Okay? They make two different types of work gloves. Your standard leather gloves and then they make work gloves that is made of the same materials of these chaps. So if they were to touch a chain, it would lock the chain up within seconds so you would not possibly lose a finger. Anytime in operating a chainsaw, you need to wear some form of ear protection, whether it be ear muffs, something as simple as a ear plug, and a pair of OSHA or ANSI approved safety glasses. Whether they be clear or smoke, depending upon the time of day you're operating, is your choice. We have some other options when you're running a chainsaw. If you are operating a chainsaw, at ground level and you're not cutting anything above, say, your shoulders, you've got two choices on helmets that they recommend. First, you have an open helmet and you would just need to simply wear safety glasses and your earplugs. That way you would be properly covered from here up. The other option that's very nice and I use myself, is this method. It's a combination system to where you have a ANSI OSHA approved helmet, you have ear protection built in, and you have a safety visor in front of it. So when this is put in, you can put your ear muffs down, you're sealed up or down when needed, and you have everything you need right there. Those are your two choices in helmets. This is going to cover most of your essentials that you need to meet any types of requirements, usually working for a city, state, or a commercial business, or if you're just a simple weekend warrior.